Most rice plants will die if submerged in water for just three days. And in India and Bangladesh, an estimated four million tons of rice are lost each year because of flooding. That is enough to feed 30 million people. But a new variety developed by scientists can withstand two weeks of flooding. Pamela Ronald, a plant biologist at the University of California, helped create the new variety with colleagues at the International Rice Research Institute near Manila. She says they began with an ancient rice strain that farmers knew could survive long periods underwater. It was not in use, very, very low yielding and very poor flavor, so no one was eating it. So it was, it's really more like a, a grassy weed but it had these properties. She says they worked to identify the gene or genes for flood resistance and then transferred the property to another kind of rice with high yield and good flavor. Then we could transfer just those genes into the varieties preferred by growers in India and Bangladesh. And so the, we were hoping to develop a new rice that retained all those uh, traits that were important to those growers but also had this additional gene. Using a technique called precision breeding, they transferred the flood resistant property to a popular kind of rice known as Swarna. The new variety is called Swarna Submergence 1 or Swarna Sub 1. Farmers did field tests in eastern India and Bangladesh. Ronald says yields increased two to five fold. We wanted to hear how what kind of difference it made to their families. And a couple of the women told me that they were able to feed their family and they had extra rice to sell, which is really important in those areas to bring in a little cash for some other things. The new rice type is in the final stages of certification in India and Bangladesh and should be widely available within two years. Mike O'Sullivan, VOA News, Davis, California.